What's happening guys, Celtic CC here. I'm on my main account and I've managed to get Dynamica on the account. Now, since all COVID started, I've gone like free to play and I haven't spent any money on the game. Um, but I had a load of magic powder left over, so I was just chipping away at floating on and eventually got him. Um, obviously, because you need backups to take him any further, I can only get him up to 200 non-evolved. Um, <clears throat> I went with Dragon Cover, level 10, because on Reddit someone said Dragon Cover with his, was his best... Um, best talent so i just went with it right i put the new pet on him uh destiny wise obviously you can't get him up very high at the moment so he's up to level 25 and i put a survival on him i haven't actually like tested him out when i'm like you know solo in anything yet i've used him in expeditions and didn't really notice uh, notice how good he was so i'm just gonna do your normal uh, my normal sort of like hero uh test just to see how good he is um you know, I mean, obviously, like, you know, Dynamica on the game, since I've been coming up against him, just seems stupidly OP. Um, but obviously, I'm probably going up going up against, like, people who've got it, like, fully maxed and everything, break through level 30 and things. Right. So, just want to see what he's, like, non-evolved, like, you know. Um, hopefully, the survival gives him an extra bit of tank ability. Um, you know, I mean, as a hero, he looks pretty cool. So, we'll see how good he is against troops. He seems to come with a lot of dodge, which is cool, and a bit of healing. So he doesn't seem to be, he's putting down a little bit of snipe damage. He got rid of a minute there. Um, you know, he's not putting down mega amounts of damage. I just want to see what he's like when he actually kind of faces all the heroes, like, do you know what I mean? I might test him out in a raid as well, see if he's any good in a raid. So he, he he's a bit of a s slow coach with regards to taking out buildings, but as you can see there, um, he has he is putting down snipe damage as well. And do you know what I mean? He, I mean, he's taking out these heroes without needing to go near them. So his snipe damage is definitely very powerful. So is it, even non-evolved, he's pretty beast. <laughs> It's, it's interesting actually, it's cause like I'm not I'm not sure whether the you know try using him instead of one of the legendaries like, do you know what I mean? But he definitely seems pretty good. I mean the thing is I, I just don't know if I'm gonna if I got enough magic payder to get another backup of him to get him any any higher. But as you can see, he went through this dungeon and he fucking sniped a lot of them. <laughs> so he's definitely very bad. And this is this is non evolved now, like do you know what I mean? It's just level normal level two hundred. Okay. But that, you know, that dungeon being old, it's not always the, the kind of, it's, it's like my, uh, so what you see, the, um, the fucking, that's my first test, like, you know what I mean? Like that old school dungeon. But let's see what he's like in a raid and see if he's any good. You know, I mean, I don't know if I'll ever be able to, I don't want to put him up against fucking big group of them. It's not really a fair test. Put him up against slow, solos against someone. Okay, this looks like an easiest base, so let's put him up against this Minotaur, see how well he does. Okay, so the survival is kicking in. Um, I mean, he is taking a lot of damage, it's to be expected. See if he can bring that. Nah. No good against them, there must have been an Empire as a Virica. And he couldn't break through that minute there. So, um, I'll try him one more time. Spend the 10 gems, why not? But it doesn't look like, based on that test, he's going to be good enough to go on the base. I mean, he's fine to have in, like, for expeditions and stuff like that. And as a backup hero for certain game modes. But I think, um, not evolved, he's not quite going to be up to par. I mean, he was good in that dungeon, though. Don't get me wrong, that sniping he did was excellent. But, you know, that dungeon is just kind of a... It's an old-school dungeon, let's face it. Now, I mean, most of the new heroes you can pretty much solo that dungeon with now. Let's see if we can find a fucking base, log. Like. Right, I'm just trying to find one where... I can go one-on-one -on -one with something. Oh, let's see what we got here. This severe, let's see how he fares against this Severica, then. One on one. That's a breakthrough level 30, Zavirica. And he died instantly. 
Yeah, no, nah, so he's not up to par to, you know, replace anyone on the base who's up to break through level 30. But I thought I'd test it out, you know, just to see. Um, you know, I mean, for a non-evolved hero, though, he's not he's not terrible. Do you know what I mean? I'll definitely find a use for him in some game modes. But he's definitely not good enough to be replacing anyone on the base, so I'm sticking with legendaries for now. Um, you know, I mean, if I get backups in the future, I might do another test. But I just, I just thought I'd do a test of him non-evolved because I know not everyone's going to be able to just, you know, get him fully maxed and everything yet. All right, and cheers, guys.